Okay, so there were there are two options that when we're selling the battery for you, it either come pre-assembled like this, or they come separate in individual cells. Now, do keep in mind, each pack or cells that it's delivered together, they need to be used together. You cannot separate them because they're balanced and matched. Uh, if you start to mix and match different battery packs, it's not good for the car, it's not good for the battery. We try to avoid that, okay? So now, I'm gonna show you to uh, remove the old battery and then install the new singular ones. But there are some main points we need to talk about here. Uh, there are times that when you see the uh, old battery or the, the, the brackets, um, you wanna come over here? Some of the battery uh, bars, you can see that these are connected. So when you are trying to remove it, do not remove your battery cells this side. It's connected on the opposite side of this bar because this one, you cannot install the battery pack towards this way. It's being blocked. And another uh, concern that we need to be um, uh, mindful of, it's when you remove and disconnect the four 12 millimeter um, nuts that's holding the bracket, the battery might be swelled and sometimes they pop. So be careful, place a hand on the side, hold it in case it does pop. That way you don't have the battery drop on you. Let's demonstrate how to uh, get the battery uh, brackets removed. Oh, you see that pop? That's what I'm talking about. So place your bracket on the side. Now the next thing is make sure you, when you remove these, you follow the same sequence when you're reinstalling them. So once you remove and install the battery, this is how it looks. Now there is a very important um, uh, mindful uh, position of the battery bracket. Let's come take a look on the side. So on the battery monitor uh, module side, uh, BMS, it's, there's only two holes. Make sure you uh, remember that. And on the right side, the passenger side, there's actually three. So be mindful of that because when you're installing them, they need to be in the right position. Next up, I'll show you guys how to re uh, install new bus bars and the uh, nuts. Every set of uh, battery pack comes with new copper bus bars and hardened steel so that we could avoid any potential uh, corrosions and replace uh, them brand new. So let's go check that out. Okay, in this next step, I'll demonstrate uh, to you guys how to replace these bus bars. So um, this is the one that's towards the backside and these are the one on the front. So normally, uh, these bus bars, they get corroded and um, they need to be replaced. If uh, the, there's a lot of leakage from the battery, from the old battery, and if you don't replace them, they are going to cause issues for our new battery. So the trick is really, you stick your finger on the very back end, push up like that. It comes out. Same thing. Up, out, and then we'll put the new one in. So make sure you follow however you removed it, you install it the same way. Click it in and they snap in like that. Put it in the right position, snap. See, brand new ones like this, okay? And on this, uh, I kind of removed this here. Slightly different because there's actually an extra piece. Just pry that up, do the same thing. One thumb push back and the other index finger Push up like that. Up, out, up. Now this is under the chrome piece. The copper piece is always under the chrome piece. Snap it in. Like that. Another piece, pull this up, snap that in. Put it in like that. This is, there you go. Now make sure these holes are aligned. Otherwise you're gonna have a nightmare putting the um, 
align them to the battery. All right, so we're gonna install these bus bars. Put the new ones in, make sure you just snap them on there. Make sure these, one, these two in the rear are for the um, battery disconnect. So you skip those two, pop them in here. So like I said earlier, we get new hardware. Just put these hardened steels nut on. All right, this step is gonna be tedious, takes a long time. We're gonna fast forward it for you and we're gonna just install it. Okay, so after installing the bus bars and replacing the battery modules, this is what it looks like. This is now the new pack with the old brackets. Now just reverse installation, install the sensor, the brackets, the casing, uh, the BMS module, the relay box, reassemble everything, uh, scan the vehicle for faults, Roll test the car and you're all set. Thanks for watching.